What's up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here and we're doing another episode of My Morphin Collection and today we have um, that figures from the new Power Ranger movie so we have um, this six pack here with all five Rangers and Goldar and then we have the Alpha um, so super excited to get into these um, I'm really getting into the new Power Ranger movie stuff here I really like the look of it and everything and so as you can see we have this Target exclusive um, six pack so you get all five Rangers and then the Goldar um, Kind of like spoiler there for the movie and stuff. At least I hope he's going to be in the movie since they made a toy of it and stuff. Um, but as you can see, we have the Target exclusive logo there. So the thing that makes these difference is their like body is more of like a has like a metallic tint to it. So kind of like um, they do with the um, old Power Ranger movie character stuff. They make a metallic. Um, but like you can really see with like the um, yellow and pink Ranger. Like of course you'll see it when I take it out of the box. But they're um, like outfits you can kind of see through them so they're a little like uh, opaque and stuff like that where the actual action figures are just solid whatever color they are so there's that and then we have the alpha that goes along with them so this is just the normal version and stuff so we'll just go ahead and get into all these and before I do I guess on the back here it does show that there's um, gonna be more coming so there's definitely a Rita which is the very first one there and then um, I'm not exactly sure. I'm sure that's like a putty and maybe that one's a putty. But I don't know who that's going to be exactly. If it's going to be uh, Zordon. Or not Zordon. Uh, Lord Zed. Because he's supposed to have something to do with the movie. Or if it's going to be possibly the Green Ranger maybe. Because I've heard rumors that he may be in it. And stuff so I'm not exactly sure. But we'll go ahead and get into it here. So I may have to... Um, pop all these out but um, to spare the noise but you'll know obviously I think I will so I'll probably pop all these out and then show you the rest of it okay so I got them all open now so we'll just go ahead and start and look through so we'll start with the red ranger so it's gonna be hard to see kind of the background here and stuff um, but so as you can see it just looks um, almost like the pop I did a few weeks ago you can see the um, detail on his outfit of course these are cheaper action figures so they're not as highly detailed they do have like engravings on them and stuff um, so you can see on the back and everything and then of course has like the di uh, diamond chest plate and stuff like that and then it's got the belt buckle there and everything and each of them comes with like a little I guess weapon thing like um, Jason's here is supposed to be a sword even though he doesn't hold it very well and stuff but it's kind of like an energy sword or like plasma sword and stuff so you can see it's just a little thing he holds on to and stuff um, I don't know why he has one and the others don't because I don't know if this is supposed to be his um, actual sword weapon that he has or if it's supposed to be like their guns that would also turn into a little weapon that each ranger had so, so I'm not exactly sure um, but so there's the red ranger again oh, it's hard to tell with the stuff but you can um, you may not be able to see it but how you can kind of see through see it better with other ones um, so now we have the blue ranger here which I really like his helmet I can really see it on this one compared to the pop and stuff how he has like a little like lift up blade type thing on the back of his head kind of like how a triceratops has like the big fan on the back of its head and stuff so that's really cool and so of course you can see the detail in his outfit too and of course his morpher there and everything and then um him and the rest of the rangers have these like little i, I don't know like plasma fist type things um they're just little like plasma things that they hold in their hand which i'll do one here in a second um but yeah, it's just supposed to be like there's fire or something coming off their fist as they're punching or something. Um, it's kind of cool, but like I said, since they all have it, I don't know if it's supposed to be like their whole gun type thing or what exactly. But um, since they all have it, I'm not exactly sure. Uh, so next up we have the Yellow Ranger, which the girls look really weird because they're so skinny. And they have like really tall necks. The Pink Ranger, I think, is even worse. Um, but so they just are super skinny, like way, way too skinny. But again, she has the little like fire fist thing and stuff. And then again, you can see the detail on her outfit and stuff. And the head, this one doesn't really have any um, more pronounced like head detail. Except for like you can, it's hard to see because it's all yellow. But um, you can definitely see more of like the saber tooth head in her helmet than you could on like the pop version and stuff. But it's really cool. Now we go with the pink ranger. And like I said, this one for me, her head seems a little like, like her neck seems really long. And then so she has like this bulbous head and then a long neck and then her body and stuff. But again, they're super skinny. Like 
I feel like an arm or some leg's going to break off real easy. But again, um, she also has the um, little plasma thing on her fist. And with the girls, their hands are so small that when you put it in, which it's like a normal, so like each one is the same size. So when you put it in the um, smaller hands of the girls, it's almost like it's going to like break their thumb off and stuff, like stretching the hand out. So they don't hold it very well. Um, but to me, she's like one of the best ones. Like I said, on camera, you may not be able to see it, but to see the like um, see-throughness of them and stuff. Like I said, may not be able to see it on camera, but she um, is the best to see that. And so then finally out of the Rangers, we have the Black Ranger now. And again, he kind of blends in with the background stuff. But again, you can see his morpher and the diamond and all the blue on his chest and stuff. Um... You don't really see any form of Mastodon with his helmet though, but again, um, you have this as their fist thing and there's just a little um, peg in there and it just slides into the um, hand. How they hold on if I can get it in there. And so then it just sits on their fist. So it's like, again, like they're punching and there's like some sort of flame or like force or fire, plasma, whatever you want to call it coming off of it. And then the last one out of this um, six-pack set is Goldar, which is the whole reason I bought this set, because I really wanted this Goldar, because I haven't seen any um, other versions of it yet. Um, but I think it's really cool, because I always like Goldar in the old show. Of course, this doesn't look really anything like Goldar, except for that he has wings, and then like the horns on his head and stuff. Um, but it still looks really cool. Um, like, I've heard people say it looks like a, they took Goldar, and then held a f um, flame to him and just let him melt and that's what this <laughs> turns into and so you can really see the name of Goldar because he's just solid gold I don't know if in the movie he'll have more textures or colors or anything else added to him because like, I really like the old one where he had like the blue face and stuff it looked like an actual creature just wearing all gold armor and stuff but, I, but the way it sounds with like the plot leaks and stuff it sounds like Goldar is going to be a pretty important uh, part of the movie and stuff and I, so I just really wanted this figure and then I also wanted all the others, so I saw this set, and so I bought them all. I believe, um, if you're buying them right now at the time of recording this, obviously if you wait years or something um, in seeing this video, um, as of right now, you can get this complete set for um, $50, I think, and then um, each, like if you buy them all individually, they're $10 a piece, so you get six, so you're pretty much getting one free. So it's pretty much like Goldar's free. And then finally we have um, Alpha 5, which besides the um, round head and stuff, doesn't look anything like the original Alpha. Um, I'm kind of disappointed with this, like I don't like it, but maybe after seeing the movie and stuff like that, he'll be okay. But he's got really long arms, as you can see. He looks like a bug. And then he's got those giant eyes, which of course Alpha just had like the um, light that would go back and forth and stuff um, on his forehead, So, and I like that a lot. But this one obviously looks like he has two different eyes. But he's got the same like web, like graded material um, that the Zords had and stuff and then it's some little design on the, um, the actual Rangers itself but it's still cool I mean size comparison wise he is a little shorter than the um, Rangers and stuff but not by much maybe a little stand out more um, but he's not by much we're in the show I assume it was a small person that played Alpha or a kid or something um, but that's gonna be it for all the Ranger um, Rangers for the new of course Power Ranger movie. So all the action figures and stuff that they have so far. Um, I'll definitely buy the rest of them once they come out and everything. And then um, I may show pictures of some because there's only by the thing there's only four, I think. So unless they release more, it wouldn't be worth a video to do four. But maybe. Um, but if you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments down below which um, Ranger is your favorite out of this just by based on costume or look. It could be Alpha. It could be Goldar. I know they're not Rangers, but um, just which action figure you thought looked the best. Um, so please leave a comment below letting me know that. And subscribe to see more, and we will see you next time.